The song says, I gave it over to the Lord. Y'all hear me now. The song says, I gave it. Anybody got anything you want to give over to the Lord? Get it a one more shot. I gave it. You see, when you really give something to the to, 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 to the Lord, you don't want it back. And when you look at it again, you'll see it in a different manner. Only God knows how to work it out. I, 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 I'm getting ready to go to my seat. I just need about four or five witnesses in this house that can say you gave something to the Lord and he worked it out. I just need somebody. God Almighty. God Almighty. God Almighty. Somebody ought to be able to encourage somebody next to you and say if you don't have the strength to give it up I'll help you put it in the hands of the Lord cause he can work it out God will God will he will he will he will, he will, he will. I tried him and I know he will work it out. Well, well, I see us, all of us, witnesses standing up but I got one that's standing outside the door that's just waiting to come in here and help us out. Open the door, Usher. Let Daniel come in here. Tell Daniel to come in here. Daniel said, I was sitting in a lion's den. I was ready to be eaten up by a lion. But God showed up in the midst of my den and delivered me. Somebody, you're in a lion's den. Somebody, you got troubles. But all of us need to know that when we put it in the hands of the Lord, he will. Just like he didn't take the lion's teeth out of the lion's mouth, but he shut the lion's mouth. And no matter what troubles come up against us, all we got to do is hold on to the hand of God. Hold on to the word of God. And he will deliver. He will work it out. God will. He never asked us to work out anything. All we got to do is trust in the Lord. Not just with your lips. Not just with your hands but with all our hearts. Give him everything. And what don't look good right now, stop looking at it with your natural eye and see beyond what you see. 
we got to start looking at our destiny and know that when God is working it out, he's in control. Everything will be all right. Heads are bowed, eyes are closed. God, we thank you for a supernatural move of your Holy Spirit. Thank you for reminding us that it is you that supply all our need according to your riches and glory by Christ Jesus. Thank you, God, for your perfect peace that surpasseth all understanding. Thank you, Lord, for even in the midst of trouble, you said you'd revive us. We give you praise now, God, for who you are and what you continue to do in our lives. Father, we know there's trouble everywhere, but we also know that you are everywhere. And you won't let anything overtake us that you hadn't already provided a way out of it. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we bless you. We thank you for healing and deliverance. We thank you for wholeness. We thank you for sound minds. We thank you for peace in our hearts. We thank you for salvation. We thank you, oh God, for sanctification. We thank you for our family's salvation. We thank you for our family's sanctification. We bind every trick of the enemy to you, and we loose it from us in the name of Jesus. Have your way, God, in every one of our lives. Lead us, God, in the path of righteousness for your name's sake. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and forever. And all of God's children said amen. Amen. Let's bless the Lord, y'all. Let's bless the Lord today. We might not see another day, so let's bless him today. Let's bless him today. When you think about how good he's been to us, let's bless him today. When we think about where we should have been, and where we are right now, let's bless him.